<laughs> yeah. If I had known about this, I would have put it in my last vid. But here we go. So also today, aside from getting the official release date for Spider-Man 2, we also got the official pre-order date and confirmation of all the different editions, their prices, and what they include. Shit is great. Now first, the beginning pre-order date is 8 days from now, June 16th, at 10 a.m. At whatever your local time zone is, 10 a.m. Now a pre-order for any edition gets you two additional suits, one for Pete and one for Miles. And both additional suits come with three different colorways each. So we're basically getting six additional suits. Now Pete's suit is called the Arachnite suit. And Miles' suit is called the Shadow Spider suit. And both make you want to shed a tear because of the pure dopeness of each suit. Now you also get three skill points to start you off. Now let's be clear, this is three total. So it's not three for Pete and three for Miles. So choose wisely because the number is odd. You also get this web grabber gadget, which is wildfire. And remember, this is a pre-order of any edition. Now speaking of editions, let's get into the first one. So it's no surprise the first edition is the standard edition. It'll be coming in at $69.99 or $70 cause y'all know tax. And the standard edition just comes with the base game. Whether you get the standard edition digitally or physically, it's just the base game. Again, unless you pre-order it. Now the second edition is digital deluxe edition. And that's coming in at 80 beans. Well, $79.99, but we already discussed the tax situation. Now I know 80 isn't cheap, but it does include everything you get from the pre-order bonus, plus 10 new suits. Five for Pete, and five for Miles. Now the five new suits for Pete are the Tactical Suit, the Orantia Suit, the 25th Century Suit, the Stone Monkey Suit, and the Apocalyptic Suit. And for Miles, it's the Agamat Suit, if I pronounced that right, the Red Spectre Suit, the Encoded Suit, the Biomechanical Suit, and the Tokusatsu suit. And the irony of the Digital Deluxe Edition is that you get the pre-order bonus regardless of whether or not you actually pre-order it, which is kind of fire. And essentially means that you can get the pre-order bonus at any time as long as you get the Digital Deluxe Edition. And no bow? That's not all. You also get two additional skill points to total at five because you're including the pre-order bonus. And you get some additional photo mode thing. Or items, I should say. And more specifically, it's additional photo mode frames and additional photo mode stickers. Now granted, with it being 10 more dollars in the standard edition, you are basically paying one dollar for each new suit. But the fact that you get the pre-order bonus, two new skill points, and the additional photo mode items, I say it's pretty worth it, fam. Now the last and damn sure not least edition is the collector's edition. Now the collector's edition does come in at 230 beans. Now don't get your boy wrong, he understands that that's bread bread. But it does come with a voucher for the Digital Deluxe Edition, a 19 inch statue with Venom fighting Pete and Miles, and this beautiful ass steel bookcase with this beautiful cover art. And you know how your boy feels about steel bookcases. It's my weakness. But, and with all that being said, man, word to Q, today was a good day. But that's all I have for y'all today, man. Y'all let your boy know down in the comments which edition you're planning on getting. And remember, if you plan on getting the Collector's Edition, it's limited. So if you want that, you're going to have to jump on that. You got eight days to decide. I'm going to catch you on the next video, alright? I love y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.